Welcome back everybody. Today we have another update on Ratio. As you see, we have a vlog and then we have a tech update, maybe on the light phone or maybe on Ratio, whatever it helps us to become more uh, mindful and restore that balance that we're seeking. If you're new to the channel, that's what we talk about here, tech, digital minimalism, and good habits. So if that's something that interests you, make sure to subscribe. And as the description says, I'll be doing a giveaway, 20 codes of Ratio. Block graciously has given us 20 codes to give to the community. So thank you, Block founders and the developer team. You guys are making an excellent job, so thanks a lot. And 20 lucky winners will get access to Ratio. So if you haven't gotten it so far, this is a kind of like a faster way, increased chances to get it. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel and comment down below. I'll run a random comment picker and then we'll proceed from there to get you kind of like started with um, ratio. So make sure to subscribe and comment why do you want ratio. Uh, without anything else, let's get to the video update 3.2. Here we have it, ratio 2.0. As you see, there is a lot of visual changes, uh, but first I wanna show you that if you want to make sure that you know what's changing from the change log or anything, you can just click right here on ratio settings and you'll be able to see what has been improved or what is coming kind of like since the latest time that you update it. So we're going to go back and I'm going to show you the things that have changed a uh, little bit by little bit. So a couple of things that the most obvious things that change are the drawers. As you see, they're not at the top. Now there's a space where you can put uh, different root cards from uh, the other panel. So if you want to, uh, you know, kind of like pin your weather, now you can have it in both. So again, you know, for more productivity at a glance information, you don't have to be going from app to app. The other thing is the animated icons right there. You're going to see the animation and then of course, a kind of like a layout change instead of being on the side. Now it's more present. Now it's more obvious. And then you can just click right there and you can go around with the different animated icons, the one that suits best, whatever your folder, whatever your drawer is going to be about. We're going to leave it with the original one right there. So those are some of the things. There's still some bugs and glitches. Again, this is a beta, uh, but it's very, very nice. Another thing that I want to show you is the new view from the um, news. So right here we have the Wall Street Journal. That's just the one that I open every time uh, just to kind of like, you know, it's the first one that comes up in the ratio. So instead of going straight into the article, it gives you a nice little preview. And that nice little preview, you decide if you want to open the article or if you want to go back. And that happens in only in there, but it's coming to other areas as well. Now, as you see, I have a note right here. We're going to pin it to the lock screen. We're going to tap right here, lock screen, and then we're going to see it right there. So if you want to remind yourself something quick, maybe grocery list or whatever, it makes you more productive. You don't have to unlock and go find the notes. We're going to touch here to this miss uh, right here, and then we're going to authenticate and we're back. So those are some of the main changes that have happened. There's not a lot of new features that have been added, but just enough visual changes. And again, you can check the change log if you want to get a little bit deeper. But again, having these cards right here, you can have up to three. Uh, it's really helpful because now, you know, I can access my playlist or my music here instead of having to go to the app and change it or instead of having to switch around back and forth between the root and the main page. And now uh, there is a preparation and the next update, we're going to get the tree feature, which is the conversation hub, which is super, super exciting. I want to show a couple more things when it comes to the ratio settings. And again, this is not a big update but it's a good one. Um, now we have the background opacity is a little bit better. As you see, you can maybe have a wallpaper in the back. I don't know if you can appreciate it with all the glare from the camera, but maybe uh, we'll see if we can show you. No, it's not showing. That's fine. Uh, maybe you can see it. Maybe you cannot. But the background opacity is better than before. It used to have a big bug that did not allow it. Uh, disable sun mode when living ratio is another feature. We're going to activate sun mode. Uh, so let's say that you want to go into a specific app. Let's activate sun mode. And then you go into, let's say, uh, Spotify. When you come back, it's going to be disabled once you leave the ratio main page. So uh, I don't know which, or I mean, maybe you have a specific app that you want to work. Maybe it's just something for, you know, kind of like having it. I keep it off because I don't see a lot of functionality with that. Block disconnection has been fixed. 
and now of course it has a battery drainage right there that it says warning high impact on battery you should keep the setting off when you're not using block desk as it will have an impact on your battery life and of course i keep it off right there then you have enable grayscale mode use ratio as an assistant app those are previous ones and then tiles right here you can edit the drawers right there and it requires your fingerprint nowadays so it gives me back right here to the drawers we're going to edit and i have to look at my fingerprint and boom you can go back so not a random person can just click and you know remove everything that you have worked so hard for it setting it up in your ratio app um let's go back to those uh, ratio settings to keep showing you what's kind of new a uh, notification pill speed has been fixed for some users then you have the drawer icons if you want to remove them you can remove them and we're going to go back and as you see there's nothing else in there i like to keep them because i think they look really nice uh and so we're going to up in them right there and then the notification setting access usage access number of columns uh, display search at the bottom, so on and so forth, faster animations. That's kind of like some of the stuff that hasn't changed yet, but it's coming up. Uh, lastly, i like to say, you know, this is a short video, again, just seeing what are some of the improvements. If you want to participate in the giveaway, we're going to be giving away 20 codes, thanks to the block team. Uh, we're going to be giving away 20 codes. If you don't have ratio and you want it, just make sure to subscribe to the channel and comment why you want ratio. We'll pick a random, you know, 20 random comments and then you can be a winner and get ratio for your device. So make sure to enter that. Uh, that's it for today. That's it for this update. But again, it's becoming a really great alternative for digital minimalism with Android. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.